Hey guys, welcome to VHS. It's actually... I actually played, I think, a game that was called VHS already a long time ago. But this is a, a new thing on Game Jolt. And it was just uploaded 19 hours ago and it was like hot. So many... like 500 people played it already. So I was like, what? So of course I gotta jump on this. Uh, the resolution is a bit weird. As you can see, there's a little... there's a black bar here. So it's not widescreen. Um, so I just put it to the side, so I'm covering less of the corner, I guess, of the game. Uh, let's see what it is. I, I have no clue. I just saw people played it, five people said it was perfect, the rating, so... Let's have a look at the demo. Whenever you see someone in front or next to you, point your flashlight directly at him, press and hold space to shine the light in his eye. In his eyes. If you do it right, in a few seconds he will go away. If you do it wrong, keep watch of your flashlight's battery. Okay. Oh! Jesus! Hi. It's right in my face! Yeah, okay. So, this is all I can see. So, I just need to keep an eye out for him? Do I need to do anything? Oh, does that mean he's coming? That's weird. Now I'm, yeah, I'm almost in front of him. So far so good though. Is there nothing else I need to do? Hmm. It very much reminds me of, uh, there is. Five Nights at Freddy's, of course. Okay, so there's a sound cue when he's close, when he appears. So then I just have to have a look around and I hope. Huh. In your face. Go away. Thank you. I actually uh, kind of like the first Five Nights at Freddy's, but it's not my kind of game. Um, it's like the managing aspect that kind of... Ah. That I'm not really into. But I certainly enjoyed it. It was really good. I, like everyone else in the world, watched Markiplier play it. Ah! You're closer! Get away! I mean, he was closer here, but now he was like in the room and stuff at the door. So please don't be right in my face next time. Something happening to my screen? Ah. He really likes that corner. Okay, we still have a minute 40 to go. But yeah, after that- ooh, he's a bite by the end- bed end. Okay. I'm gonna be out of power soon. Um, I really like the first Five Nights at Freddy's, but after that- ooh. It soon became a little bit tedious. Definitely like what the guy's done and how he like changed it up every game. Definitely props to him. I think they're pretty good games. Personally, I just and of course when they were like hyped up, when they just came out, I had didn't have my channel yet. So, like if they came out now for the first time, then I probably would have played it. You know, that's just how things go. 40, 44 seconds. 40? Um, huh? Okay, I got this. He's probably gonna appear more now. I don't know why. Why he chose this resolution, but it's actually kind of fun in a quirky way because it's like VHS and... If he wanted to do it really correct, the game should have been like 4x3, you know? Make it like six, 640 resolution. <laughs> 640 pixels, I mean. That would be funny. In your face! Ah! No, I did it! Is that the demo?
Thank you for playing the demo. Full game coming in July. Okay. So, there's a good idea here. That's for sure. There is some potential in here. But it's too simple as it is now, I think. Um, because, of course, Five Nights at Freddy's is good because it has multiple layers. There's the layer that you have to switch between cameras, but you can't see everywhere at the same time. Then there's the sound cues, so you know something's about to happen. Um, and then there's the doors that you have to, like, uh, close at the right time. And there's the lights that you can use to, like, see if they're still there or not. There's So there's way more layers to it than what this this one only had. Look around and press spacebar when the, you hear him. So this was overly simplified compared to that. And I am going to compare it to that because I think that's what it was trying to imitate. Uh, or at least it was inspired by Five Nights at Freddy's, for sure. So if there is a full game on the way, coming in July, so that's this month... So I'm not expecting a lot more um, than gameplay-wise than what we just did. So I'm probably not really excited for the main game. I would be excited if he introduces more game mechanics, more depth story. It says no storyline right now. Uh, if there would be a story and more things you had to do, then the, pro the game probably became would become more interesting. But as of now fun for four minutes the couple minutes that I spent playing it but that's probably it um, it was enjoyable for like the first minute I was like oh where is he coming but that's about it I'd say surprise this game has been played so many times and has so many ratings already um, maybe the dude I'll have to check him out maybe he had maybe he made some games in the past that are really popular or something I don't know in any case um, but that was it. I hope you guys liked it. It was a very short experience. Um, and we're gonna move on and see what else we can find. Bye!